Na nuralimu abantu wa wamanga Edadu watu ula bulonji nyo Na ye ngenda kusoma manyaga Na mwini mweli nyali si ngenda kwa atu Na nini nini nyali no Eyalimu seti ya usena kasero Chima nyinti nkumanyi wali yo Ntandis went Miti ngeni ya limu Dr. Chiza Besi Jejifefe Mwani Mugisha Montu David Itinyefunza Abel Kandiho Oni yate ledua kwa Echibone Lezo Mwhozi Kanyirugaba Kale Chezi Kayuhura Mwani Mu Yowari Kaguta Museveni Yenjini Ne Mama Assassin ya limu Na ike Bobango Chimanyi Nga wani mu miti ngeno Nga ate watu ukareti Ne Ngori Ne Kanchileke Kanchileke Neche tegele niti wumutu ye nochi meti wali mumiti ngevo Nga wefu lancho limo opposition Ilango kwa wangote limo opposition Mkulaba mkuru Mumiti elinja lino kandi siri kile For the sake of Ugandans Kandi siri kile Kumanga mwenso merinja lijia kule tatagali Kandi siri kile Neche manyenti Bobo wali mumiti ngevo wakuna mstate house na kasero Kumanya genso mienga wate nga meeting but Very late wajarete But you agreed with each and everything which was discussed on chimanyiti na kutegira edana tegede niti uori nize maso mubi nitu ebi atasi wako mjukila konga tuchi ya gena mkalu na waga amba konti nga basaji ya balu waine teka teka etandika okutiginya emoto kasa bakule mbeze abali mchivina cha nopu unomuli mba mba pari ya medina bakule mbeze mchivina cha nopu okuziti ginya nga basa sula insindi mpiani nkade nga bazi uwa mba kani kaji baba wazi kanikila obani uzi kula service okubanti bate mpari nga na zoo nji omotu ye na abaji kwa zisa wabanga agenda mungene pamfu emotu kia mchankana na eko emokube echigo era emotine wo mchino nino walu mwanyi na ze ali mkwange di amerika mamu sindi kilo omotu ju na achimu kora emilu ndi evili ele motoka emotoka ze yeye njini jievu gira baji kule chintu chechimu wepo ni motoka jiezi kwa kubwa kumukwano gwe baji kule chintu chechimu chino chechokula vila kuchi mba gamba mamu sindi kilo omotu ju nenga ata yefu ni mkwano gwe ya tempali nga ni motoka ze kwa kumati motoka ze wazungu ze 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 moda nikati e kubuli nanti muna nge imili mpila mifu muna nge ingi ni chamo se oba waluwe chitagenda kudungi mple chizo ni motoka no jiteke bali singata chari chino singa mwa njina zono mfu kubanga abasajia bamo sindi kila abatamanyi bamo sindi kila mutamanya ngamba nenga atenda yebo mwoso mako olijimie mwosajia averi abataga ni nadada yuganda nginze maso mwabantu awa wale duwe nsimbi okutana mboza epi kolobino mwemuli abantu manu wa manga Mwemuli tadika na chiza vesiji, mugisha muntu, wepo, nekarika yuhula, abagendo sene, okutambu za sene, zonzi wa makanika, okurundure moro kazawa na jibazi kurela service, okuzisha karanya. Eda, mwintu mino, jibako ze, bako ze, echi intu, echi takoleka, echi takoleka, echi takoleka. Enzita, ea katua, na yaba tupata nso jeke, gira kopo, katudeko plani, jituwa li tutese zako, ee motoka. Sono, nsubi nanti, aksidi, tizi zibade zikuwa mu Uganda, mwzegende, tizi nyo. Uwewe gambo, ewe genda maso mu Uganda. Nenga, mwuntu ya wade mu miti ingene, ili nyayo ni resi, ni yuki ya. Esa wazi no maniku video kuno inza kuhuzi ya kubwa kuhuli. Na yenga miti ingene wajibade mu. Oteke doku wango manyi, che mwa discussi nze, okora, kakore mbeze van nupu. Nga mwemu nubwa chagula nyi senta mu, okute palingane moto kaye. Mwuso ngendara, omukuru, nubwa chagula nyi senta mu, na kukula mbade mkusawa mkulu bobo ngende kayunga wegende leze nyo entambula yo naba ntubo niringa na bukubanga chichigabe chitegele so njara tegeza meseje eno njara kala jitegeza wakule mbeze mwana bafuge guangali ya kenya eno kanjo gire mulu zungu na mwji sindi kebulu unji this message goes direct to the president of the republic of kenya and the entire nation of kenya this is to inform you that as Time comes you are heading towards the elections of 2021 of choosing the new president of Republic of Kenya. There is a well-planned move of, of destabilizing Kenya by Yoel Kabuta Museven, the so-called president of Uganda. He had organized so many randis from different parts of East Africa to enter Rwanda and to disorganize the security system of Kenya and even to disorganize the elections. As we speak right now, I can confirm to you from reliable sources that almost 200 Randy's origin they have spies, they have entered Kenya and they are operating in different areas and different cities of Kenya. As we speak right now, some of those spies, Randy's spies, they are operating as taxi drivers, some of them they are operating as Baba in saloons, others are operating at Mombasa port and others are staged or stationed 
in different cities around Kenya. So please be aware that anytime, anywhere, if Kenya get destabilized, there is no any other person who is behind this mission is Yoel Kabuta Museveni, the so-called president of Uganda, because all along he had been planning of destabilizing Kenya, but he had failed. But right now, as we speak, 200 spies of Rada origin have already entered Kenya through different borders which bordering with Kenya. So the, uh, the, the President of the Republic of Kenya, the entire parliament and Kenyanese, please inform their government that is a, there is a plan of destabilizing Kenya during elections and after elections. Hope more Kenyanese, they have more experience about what happened in the previous elections whereby Museven sent his troops they were dressed like Kenyanese and they start beating civilians to the extent that some people lost their lives in such manner. So right now, as we speak, 200 of Rani's origin spies, they have already invaded Kenya, but they're operating in different sectors in the country. So be aware. If it was possible, the, the, the Minister of Internal Affairs and the Minister of Security, please wake up before it's too late. And also this message goes to the President of Republic of Congo, Mr. Tshekedi, I know you are aware that the Uganda government is trying to destabilize your country. Museveni himself is just beating around the bush that he went there to look for ADF rebels. That's not his mission. There are so many, uh, there are so many hidden agendas of himself invading your country. One. Last week, you heard that some of the U.S. Uh, US United States uh, Embassy staff members, their telephone gadgets, they were, uh, they were spied on. It is the same that your telephone gadgets, they were, your telephone gadgets, Mr. Shekin, they are mounted by the Republic of Uganda through the high-tech experts. So you want your telephone numbers and telephone gadgets are monitored by the public, by the, by the security organizations of Uganda, including ESO and CMY. So whatever conversation you're having between you and the other leaders of East and Central Africa, be aware that your telephone numbers or telephone gadgets are monitored through the sophisticated software but the person who is behind this is Yoel Kabuta Museveni and his entire regime because they are hiding some information and some, re and some of the reasons why they are in Congo, they are hidden. But soon or later, I'm going to inform you the reasons as, well as why Museveni is also is in, is, in what? is in Congo. So as we speak right now, before I leave Congo, let me inform the international community the reason as to why you said Tiba Habrota by Silo Museveni went to Congo. These are the five reasons as to why Museveni invaded Congo. And the first mission is Museveni didn't go, didn't go to Congo that he's looking for ADF. As I've already informed you that Museveni is ADF himself. Previously, Museveni used to create his own terrorist groups and rebel groups, and he found those groups. So the reason as to why Museveni went to Congo, first and foremost, he doesn't have money to run his government. So he went to Congo to loot Congo in terms of gold, timbers, and to justify his that work of bombing Uganda. And he claims that ADF is behind the bombing of Kampala City. No, that is wrong. This gentleman previously, in 2010, during the South Africa World Cup, this gentleman, he did the same when he got a deal of going to Somalia as a peacekeeper, but he was not supposed to take those troops to, 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 to Mogadishu because the parliament didn't allow, didn't allow him. So, you know what he did? That gentleman used his security organizations which are not registered in the, in the, in the constitution of uganda that is international uh, that is a uh, internal security organization that is iso same way and adf and and and, and up and uh, and and sfc i beg your pardon and sfc they planned of setting bombs at rugogo rugby club kabaragara and moyenga 
in 2010. These bombs were set by those organizations and those bombs claimed a lot of lives of Ugandans, innocent Ugandans, which, if, which forced him to take troops to Somalia so that he can get millions of dollars from African Union and USA and European Union, which he succeeded. But this gentleman, he lied to the world. And the same thing he's doing right now, he claims that ADF attacked Uganda and they, ate the, and, uh, and they set off bombs in Kampala. That was a big lie. This gentleman is good at camouflaging since 60s up to now. So those are the three reasons as to why he's in Congo right now. And the fourth agenda or the fourth issue of himself, be, himself taking troops to Congo, this is a hidden plan. Please, can anyone please tag the, the current president of Republic of Rwanda, Mr. Paul Kagame? I'm here to inform you because for me, I'm tired of destabilizing Africa due to the fact these people are not civilized. Museveni, you are not civilized and your entire government. The fourth reason as to why Museveni is in Congo and the reason as to why he's there, he had taken a lot of ammunition, including uh, uh, tanks, fire tanks, uh, including tanks, a huge number of fighters or soldiers, and guns, which is unnecessary because we've been asking him for the evidence to show us that where the ADF camps, they are nowhere to be seen. But the, 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 the plan behind this, this gentleman want the moment he reaches in Congo and settle there as he plans, then he turn against his fellow comrade Paul Kagame by attacking Granda directly by using M23 leader Kayumba Nyamwasa and some generals in Rwanda, Rwanda 